hello, hello, and welcome to the Rockbridge Regional Library's Baby and Toddler Storytime. My name is Miss Wendy, and during Baby and Toddler Storytime, we're going to sing a lot of songs and some rhymes and read some books together. This is a time for you and your baby to do some cuddles and play and just spend some time together. So sing along and let's have fun. Okay, now Lily. Lily is my baby's baby. My Rose's little baby and she said that I could borrow Lily to help with some of the songs. So the first song we always do is our up, down, turn around. So you can either have baby facing out or you probably would like to have baby facing in so you can look at each other and also that's great for baby looking at your mouth when you're saying words and it helps baby understand the rhythm of language and just talking. It's all learning. Okay, so here's how it goes. And babies love this because there's lots of ups and downs. Okay, one, two, three. Up, down, turn around. Touch the sky and touch the ground. Wiggle fingers, wiggle toes, wiggle shoulders, wave hello. And that's how we do our hello song. Of course, if your baby is able to stand, they might want to do the turnaround on their own. So I'll do it this way this time so you can see. One, two, three. Up, down, turn around. Touch the sky and touch the ground. Wiggle fingers, wiggle toes, wiggle shoulders, wave hello. Well, hello, my baby and toddler storytime friends. Okay, so for our next song, we're gonna do Baby Put Your Pants On. This is a great one for when it's time to get your baby dressed for the day or for nighttime or for anything. Um, and so here's how it goes. You wanna lay baby down in front of you and it goes to the rhythm of a uh, shortening bread. And we'll start with baby put your shirt on. So here's how it goes. One, two, three. Baby put your shirt on, shirt on, shirt on. Baby put your shirt on. One, two, three. Baby put your shirt on, shirt on, shirt on. Baby put your shirt on. One, two, three. Shirt to the left, shirt to the right. Wiggle and jiggle and pull it on tight. Shirt to the left, shirt to the right. Wiggle and jiggle and pull it on tight. Okay, so hopefully by then you've got your baby shirt on. <laughs> okay, so let's move on to the pants. You ready? One, two, three. Baby, put your pants on, pants on, pants on. Baby, put your pants on. One, two, three. Baby, put your pants on, pants on, pants on. Baby, put your pants on. One, two, three. Pants to the left. Pants to the right, wiggle and jiggle and pull them up tight. Pants to the left, pants to the right, wiggle and jiggle and pull them up tight. Okay, success. We've got a shirt on and we've got <laughs> pants on. Okay, now for the hard part. Socks. <laughs> or maybe socks aren't so bad. I had a hard time with socks. Shoes, really, more than socks. So let's try shoes. Okay, one, two, three. Three. Baby, put your shoes on, shoes on, shoes on. Baby, put your shoes on. One, two, three. Baby, put your shoes on, shoes on, shoes on. Baby, put your shoes on. One, two, three. Shoes to the left, shoes to the right. Wiggle and jiggle and put them on tight. Put shoes to the left. Shoes to the right, wiggle and jiggle and put them all tight. Okay, now we're ready to go. Don't forget all the stuff. <laughs> okay, good job. Now, I like to sing, I change the songs up about once a month because it's good for babies to have that recognition of the songs they miss them and that, you know, helps them to build confidence. So, let's see, I think it's time for a book. Now, yesterday, Wednesday, it was National Look Up at the Sky Day, and I didn't know there was a day for that. 
So I thought that should run over into baby toddler story time. So I have some books about the sky and the sky is wonderful. So really look up at the sky should be every day. So be sure to look up at the sky today. So let's read our first book. Okay. Now this is a fun one because, oh, have you ever been on a swing and you just want to go higher and higher all the way up into that beautiful blue sky? So that's what this book is about. Getting closer to that sky. So this is called Higher, Higher, and it's by Leslie Patricelli. Look at those clouds. Now that's something you can see up in the sky. Clouds. Are there any clouds out there today? Oh, look at that. A little girl and her dad going for a walk. Uh-oh, she sees something. <gasps> Swing! Higher, higher! And this book is brought to us by Candlewick Press. Higher! Higher! That looks fun! Higher! Higher! Oh, she's gotten so high that she can see the giraffe. That's pretty high. Look at Dad down there. He's looking pretty small. All right, let's see how high she gets. Oh, higher! Higher! Oh my goodness, look, there's the giraffe way down there. And she's so high she can see some friends at the top of the building. Higher, higher. Oh my goodness, she is so high that she is at the top of a mountain. And if, look, her friend is there too. Oh, and there's an airplane. So that is high. Do you think she can get any higher? Let's find out. <gasps> higher! Higher! Wee! Now the people in the airplane are like, hmm? But there's a dog in there, and a baby, and a person, and a person, and a person, and a pilot. And she's waving. All right, how high can she go next? <gasps> higher! Higher! Oh my goodness, she is way above the earth. That is some swing. Okay, do you think she's going to get any higher? Let's find out. <gasps> higher! Higher! Look who she found. A monkey in a rocket ship. Wow, that is high. She's around the stars. <gasps> oh, hi! Hi! I guess this alien had the same idea. Maybe that's his planet. Hi, hi, whoa, okay. Who would have thought she would meet somebody in space? Hi, five! All right. If you're up there, you might as well high five. Bye, bye! And then they go back down. From the space to the mountain to the rooftop. Whoops, to the airplane, to the giraffe. There she goes. Back to daddy. Whew. Now that is a very good swing pusher right there. Good job, daddy. Ah, think she wants to go again? Again! Yeah, I think I'd want to go again. Maybe she'll see her little alien friend. All right. I hope you enjoyed that. Well, he said, no, let's go home. <laughs> that was a lot. All right. I hope you enjoyed that book. And don't forget, look up at the sky today. See what you see. Are you looking at a night sky or a day sky? Is it dark? Is it blue? Have a look. Okay. Okay. I hope you enjoyed that book. So our next song we're going to sing uses egg shakers. So if you have a rattle or egg shaker at home, grab it. If you don't, maybe a box of macaroni and cheese or some pasta. Also, if you would like to join along at home with this 
story time pouch it has an egg shaker in it just let me know you can comment in any of the posts and i can get one of these to you there's a scarf and some rhythm sticks and an egg shaker and everybody loves an egg shaker and so here's how the song goes so i'm gonna take lily and i'm gonna lay her down in front of me of course depending on the age of your baby you can have baby sitting in front of you or laying in your lap or laying in front of you or somebody else holding baby in front of you and so here's how it goes. And it goes to the tune of London Bridge is Falling Down. Okay, here we go. One, two, three. Can you shake along with me? Along with me, along with me. Can you shake along with me? And shake your shaker on your nose. And then you can find this area and touch it really gently right there. And also, I probably should have had, baby, depending on your baby, baby can hold the shaker too and do it to you, which is really fun too. So let's do, next time, let's do feet. Okay. One, two, three. Can you shake along with me? Along with me, along with me. Can you shake along with me and shake your shaker on your feet? And get a tickle in there while you're at it. <laughs> and again, when you're saying feet and you're touching their feet, baby is putting together word and thing. And that's always, anytime you can do that, that's great. Okay, let's see. Next, let's do tummy. Why not? All right, you ready? Can you shake along with me, along with me, along with me? Can you shake along with me and shake your shaker on your tummy? So this song can go on forever. <laughs> and you can do, can you shake it on your hair, on your ear, on your, you know, elbow, that kind of thing. So this can go on forever. Don't forget. Let me know if you'd like one of these pouches. I have plenty. Okay, so next song. Let me get you up. Oh, Lily, she's getting big. <laughs> okay, so the other song I wanted to sing is one of my favorites, Grand Old Duke of York. And every child I've ever met <laughs> loves it because there's lots of ups and downs and there's lots of moving around. And so I like to have Lily facing me. One, two, three. Three. The grand old Duke of York, he had 10,000 men. He marched them up to the top of the hill and he marched them down again. And when they were up, they were up. And when they were down, they were down. And when they were only halfway up, they were neither up nor down. Yay! It's so fun. Babies love that. <laughs> At least that's what Lily tells me. Okay, let's try it again. This time I'll, I'll face Lily out. One, two, three. The grand old Duke of York, he had 10,000 men. He marched them up to the top of the hill and he marched them down again. And when they were up, they were up. And when they were down, they were down. And when they were only halfway up, they were neither up nor down. Yay! Everybody, I mean, when you do this to baby, they're like, yay! Then that's what we're doing this for, isn't it? <laughs> Very good, Lily. Very good. I also like to sometimes do the Grand Old Duke of York really fast and then also really slow. <clears throat> so here's how that goes. So we'll do it fast first. One, two, three. The Grand Old Duke of York, he had 10,000 men. He marched them up to the top of the hill and he marched them down again. And when they were up, they were up. And when they were down, they were down. And when they were only halfway up, they were neither up nor down. Yeah, super fast. And then you can do super slow. The Grand Old Duke of York, he had 10,000 men. He marched them up to the top of the hill and he marched them down again. And when they were up, they were up. And when they were down, they were down. And when they were only halfway up, they were neither up nor down. And then do it fast again, for sure. <laughs> okay, let's read another book together. Okay. This one is absolutely lovely, and it gives us an opportunity to just appreciate 
our beautiful sky. And this is by Audrey Wood. Some nice clouds. And this comes to us from Blue Sky Press. How Look at all those clouds. Blue sky. What does the sky look like today? Look at everybody's pointing. Looking up at the sky. Cloud sky. Ooh, do you see any shapes in the clouds? Rain sky. Yes. Sometimes we have rain sky. What other type of sky is there? Storm sky. Have you ever seen lightning? Have you ever heard thunder? Don't be nervous, monkey. Rainbow sky, my favorite. Looks like they're at the beach. Sun sky. Ooh, that's hot. What other type? <gasps> Sunset sky. Look at how it has turned orange as the sun comes down. And dark sky. Oh, that looks like at the night. Star sky. Star sky. Look at all those stars. Oh, the wonder of it all. And moon sky. Also a favorite. There they are. Ooh, wish sky. Do you ever wish upon a star? And good night. Sleep sky. Oh, and of course, dream sky, where there's a little bit of everything. You've got the sun, you've got the moon, you've got a rainbow, you've got clouds, you've got storms, and you've got monkey, which is awesome. New sky, blue sky, and then we start all over the very next day. Here comes the sun. Just in one day, all of those different skies. The end. Ooh, fog sky, big sky, snow sky, birthday sky, love sky, today sky, pink sky. How many skies have you seen? Well, I hope you enjoyed that book and we are going to sing our goodbye song. And just so you know, there is a preschool age story time that airs on Wednesdays at 1030s, but you can watch them anytime on our YouTube page or on our Facebook page or on our Instagram page. But so some, you might want to check that out too. Last, the, yesterday's was also about looking up to the sky. But until then, let's sing our goodbye song. It's just like our hello song, except there's a little bit different at the end. Here's how it goes. One, two, three. Up, down, turn around, touch the sky and touch the ground. Pat your tummy, blink your eyes, blow a kiss and wave goodbye. Very good. Let's do it one more time. Up, down, turn around. Touch the sky and touch the ground. Pat your tummy, blink your eyes, blow a kiss and wave goodbye. Goodbye, my friends. I will see you next Thursday at 1030 for another Baby and Toddler Storytime. Bye.